So Ross Barnett on Saturday, it's going to be a tough trip, isn't it? You know, second one on the road and the end of our kind of four, four games that we kind of earmarked as what was going to be a really tough run. Yeah, I think so. And um, we set ourselves up sort of what we wanted to get out of it. And, and, and albeit, albeit we were competitive against Wrexham and we, we didn't get anything out of it. So that's, that's obviously disappointing. And then... Um, and again, we're competitive against Dagenham, but but again, I, I think this group should be fully capable of winning. That was this, that was probably my frustrations, and and um, albeit again a tough place to go, and we we should still be going with the mindset that we can win those games. And I've said to the group today, we have to look at every game like a cup final, and every game has like it means the absolute world to us, um, and we have to put everything on the line for three points and. We get back into that mindset where we were like that for for Maidstone and Bromley and Solly Hull and and Dorkin. We can start to get points on the board, but that, that's where we need to be, and that's the mindset we need to have. Now, speaking to you after the game, speaking to Ollie Harford after the game as well, you kind of like got the impression that it was a bit of an off day for the for the for the lads on Tuesday night. But in, well, you know, this is my personal opinion. Looking back after a few games, there hasn't really been many off games. We've 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 performed pretty well. In, in a lot of them for the last few and well the last a, a lot of games so that must be encouraging yeah I mean I'm, a, I'm positive I'm, I like to think I'm a positive guy and um, but but it doesn't sugarcoat it you know there's a, mm. there's a descent you, you, you have this run of actually we, we, we have been competitive and we've, we've put a lot into whatever seven eight nine ten games whatever it was um, and we were on a bit a bit of an upward trajectory and you get to the end of it and the expectation from in within the camp is that that we win, win win those those fixtures and we didn't put ourselves in a position to do so regardless of the amount of opportunities to create chances that we got in the first half and that was probably the the real disappointment thing with it and you obviously I, I, I know we spoke to the players this morning and stuff and the the you can talk about whatever it is getting getting too comfortable or look we've made it because we were competitive against Wrexham and till they get points by the way and then competitive against Chesterfield so that was the mindset I think I think it's nice to have them serious conversations and every now and then a, a good recalibration of, of or re check yourself as sort of where we're at is is not a bad thing um, and some tough conversations is not a bad thing so um, we move into the next one with with, the, with our mindset in the right place that's the plan and that's the idea and it has to happen on on Saturday. We have to be in the right frame of mind, and we have to be going to Barnet to to think we can we can we can go there and get the win. Obviously, we we did beat them at the Ebb um, earlier in the season, but you know they 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 run a you know good run then. They run a good run now. You know they're they're flying high up there, so it's not going to be. You can't look at the the game earlier in the season and think it's going to be the same, can you? Yeah. So I did watch that game, and it was four three three v four three three, mm. and. Um, our side is absolutely massively different to that side that played that day. Um, obviously, Inny got two that day as well. So, um, and then you look at uh, their side. Their side is massively different as well, with with the addition of um, I think Smith Smith the centre forward, and um, obviously they got the boy in from from Wimbledon as well, and and they're they're playing more of a well, they've, they've played a bit of a mix. Still sitting there four three three or three five two or. Um, I think they've played some four four twos and stuff as well. So they they, they have a lot of variety. They, they they have a lot of very very good attacking players, and they've added to that group really really well. And and that's reflected in where they are on the table. So, uh, but on the other side of that, um, bar probably the last game, the disappointment, which is the disappointing thing. We we have been in a good place, and we want to now get back to being in a good place, and we want to get back to that momentum. And it's important that on Saturday we have a go and. Um, we, we go to, to Barnet and, and try and implement a game plan that's going to um, see us walk away with three points. We're now 34 games into the season, definitely approaching the business end of it with 12 games left. So, you know, let, let's have a look at what we've done under your reign. It's been about, what, five months now. So, you know, how, how have you seen everything going and, and, and what's your thoughts and, and how do we look forward? Um, there has been, uh, we're inconsistent. That has been obviously a, a thing that a lot of people have talked about. And um, in terms of this quarter um, or where we're at for this sort of last little period of what we would maybe look at 11, 13 games, we are 12 games even, sorry. Um, we, we still need that 50 point mark. So we're 12 points off that mark. and. That's where we want to get to, and and regardless of where we are placed on the table or or whatever that looks like, our our target is to get to fifty points. Um, the quicker we can do that, 
the cricket will have a bit of a um, relook at our our targets and, and maybe reassess and reevaluate. But ultimately, we want to get to fifty. Um, we want to make ourselves safe, and that's where we want to be. And I think um, in the first sort of quarter, well, we won three games, and then we had that sort of block where we won five when I first came in, and um, the last quarter there was another three wins. So um, we need to replicate more of what we did in quarter two, which which we sort of spoke about with the players as well, and just to be sort of transparent with everybody as well and, and, and look at where we want to go. But obviously we've got the trophy as well. It's important that we do well in that. But ultimately, the most important thing, or certainly, or certainly up there, is that we need, well, the most important thing is that we stay in the league um, and we're competitive and we get to this 50 points as quickly as we can. Thanks, Ross. Cheers, Sam. <laughs>